welcome back to my channel, Kids Art Toys. Thank you for joining me today. I hope everybody is having a great day. Um, I'm just here for another Toy Opening Tuesday, and I found a few things that I'd like to share. And one of them is I got another Slitherio. My daughter collects these now, thanks to me. <laughs> so she's been waiting and waiting and waiting for me to open this up. So I am going to open that up and give it to her. Um, oh, sorry, Nova. Nova's making noise. And they're doing a whole bunch of these different sands. This is a new one. It's called Mercury Sand. Holds for form and never dries out. So I thought I would open up and see what that's like. And then these are just some clearance little grow eggs that I was able to get. And as you can see, they're slightly cracked. So I'm going to put these in water right now. I don't know how long they take to hatch, but I'm going to go plop and plop. So we'll find out later. I will show you guys later. Uh, what they look like. I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm back. So, let's try to open this Slitherio and we'll see what's inside here. Which one did we get? We could have get any one, any one of these. I'd like to get a colorful one. Let's see. I don't know. Open. Is it going to be colorful? Oh. <laughs> these are not colorful. The ones I've been getting are either like black and yellow or black. Or this one's like so not colorful. <laughs> It's white and gray. I feel bad for my daughter, but that's okay. And I can see right away we got this one right here. He's still cute. I mean, I'm not saying he's not cute, but man, I'd love to get a colorful one. <laughs> so a nice white and gray Slitherio. He's cute though. He's cute. Woo. Uh, anyway, okay, so that was fun. Now let's check out this Mercury Sand. I already opened it. Ooh, oh my, this is like... I don't even know if we can get it out. Oh, this came out really nice. Look, solid block. So this claims, oh, I like this. This is good stuff right here. This is good stuff. It claims it will never dry out. I don't know if I want to test that or not. Um, and that it holds its form. Well, it certainly did when it came out. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. Woo. Yeah, it's definitely like, oh no, I lost it. It's definitely like moon sand. Um, but it does, it does, you know, hold its form very well. It's much better than the Mars sand. That was such a fail. But I like this stuff. So this is the Mercury sand. And like I said, very much like moon sand. Or no, I don't mean moon sand. I mean kinetic sand. Sorry. <laughs> I'm looking at my playset over there. Yeah, it's like kinetic sand. Very much like it. But yeah, it does hold its form very well. I think it would work good with these little, um, let's try them, these little molds they have. Let's see. Look. That worked very well. Look at that. And do the little moon beside it or something. There we go. Look at that. And it also has, um, it also comes with these little walls you can make. I will try it. Why not? I might to try to make that brick wall. I want to make a brick wall. Oh, oh yeah, look at that. I made a brick wall. Let's see if I can... I can stand up the brick wall, too. That's pretty cool. Yeah, this stuff is great. This stuff, I like this. So this is the mercury sand. It's very great. It's very, it's very nice. And I like this stuff, and I like the Venus sand. If anybody remembers, the Venus sand was the stuff you put in water, and it's like a powder until you put or sand until you put it in the water, and then it you can do stuff with it. It you can mold it and stuff in the water. Yeah, that Venus sand was very cool. So so far out of the three I have bought of this series here, I like the Mercury sand, and I like the Venus sand. But like I said, the Mars sand was a complete failure, so I would never buy the Mars sand. Poor Mars, but oh well. <laughs> so yeah, I left it. I left the brick wall on top. Okay, so that's that. I would highly recommend this. This is a lot of fun to use. So there's that. My grow eggs, of course, probably will take a while. I'll let you know when they hatch and show you what they are. And then a little Slitherio that's very pale, <laughs> white and gray, but he's still cool. All right, since that's only about three minutes or four minutes, I'm also going to do a bonus. I'm going to open up this little 
Busy Bub I, I got ages ago and I never opened her. It's Gracie. It's the Busy Bubs with the cute crib. So I'm going to open that right now. I'll be right back. I'll take it out and I'll show you what, what it's about. Okay, so I unpackaged her and I had her little pals join this one here. I forgot their names though, but the one that plays peekaboo and the one that one of the ones that crawls, but sadly, I don't know if they put their names in there. Um, yeah, no, oh, wait a minute. I think I can find out. Um, so I have Poppy and Swirly. This is Swirly and Poppy. So and this one is, <laughs> What is this one again? I forgot her name. Um, hello, what's your name? Grace. So this is Grace, or Gracie, whatever Grace. Poppy and Swirly. Huh, I have a hard time remembering them. So she's new, so I'm going to turn her, switch her on here. And where's her little button? Oh, ah, okay. She's cute. Let's see. You gonna do something? Oh, how adorable! Well, she's cutie. <laughs> so she bounces in her crib. Whoa, she really does. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Through out the crib. Aw, she looks cute out of the crib. Aw, she sang a song. Yeah. yeah, so she's really, really cute. She just bounces in her crib. And of course, whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she didn't want to lay down. And like I said, she... <laughs> I don't know if she'll stop. Are you going to stop? No, not yet. Okay. Okay, well, and she does come with, like the other two did, a little passy here, and a bottle, a little bottle, and she will take her bottle, I think, she's supposed to, maybe she's, there she goes, she's drinking her bottle, oh dear, <laughs> and, and she'll take care of her little passy. And then you can put her to bed. Well, I don't think she wants to go to bed though. <laughs> there she is. Oh, ow. <laughs> She's in her bed. Doesn't she look cute? <laughs> I always thought maybe more than one can fit into her crib, but no. Definitely not. So, yep. So that is Grace. Grace with her crib. Whoa. <laughs> I just try and put more than one in there. What about what about Poppy? Poppy can fit in there. And Swirly. So I'm gonna put this one. She still work? Oh wait a minute. I didn't turn it on. Nope. I shut them off, which was smart. There's Poppy and Swirly. Get them all. Oh, oh dear. Let me get them all going. I can put both of them in here, maybe. And she can crawl. Yay. <laughs> they look cute together in the crib. Aww. Oh, she still has her passy in her mouth. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh dear. Ugh, I can't get them to stay. Eh. <laughs> uh, I can't really get them to stay together. Oh, there we go. All right, well, anyway. <laughs> I think they're very, very adorable. So that will be my um, toy opening Tuesday for today. I did the Mercury Sand, which was really fun and it's really nice. The Slitherio, which was cute. And the Grow Eggs, which I'll show later. 
and then I tried out little Grace with her crib, with her crib, and she is very, very cute. And she's joined by Poppy and Swirly. So that is my toy opening for today. Thank you all so very much for watching. Um, if you like, you can feel free to subscribe because I do toy reviews, toy openings, crafts, and other things that are related to toys. So if you like that kind of stuff, feel free to subscribe. All right. Well, thanks so much for watching. I hope everybody has a great day. Keep having fun, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. So I am here this morning, and the dinosaur is hatched. So they're very, very cute. Um, this one on the edge here, this one was in that. But this one over, oh, there's Nova, Nova's ear. Hi, Nova. So this one over here was already out of the shell completely. I didn't move that one. But this one I moved because he was still in the shell. I helped him out. But look at the shell. These ones are actually really cool because they totally disintegrate. And they don't take long to hatch at all. So I just put them in last night. So yeah, so that's what they look like. Aren't they cute? They're very cute. I'm not sure what kind of dinosaur that one is. But this one's a stick. Uh, isn't that one a stegosaurus? something like that i know you can't really see him isn't he cute i don't know how big they get because they are the ones that grow i'm not going to bother to show a picture of them growing i just won't because <laughs> i don't feel like taking any more video of them but that is them that's the dinosaurs that came out of the eggs that i did and i think they're absolutely cute so yeah and there he is you can't see him very well there he is so cute all right well thanks very much take care bye